guys um quick question did you know that ghost is a swedish rock band known for its distinctive blend of theatricality heavy metal and arena rock formed in Linkoping in 2006 the band first gained attention with their 2010 three track demo followed by the seven inch vinyl elizabeth i can't go deeper and their debut album opus eponymous uh labels iron pegasus rise above metal blade trooper entertainment uh seven four and and loma vista what is happening guys george the cloud here my name is jorge aka george welcome to the channel and welcome to my life this music video just came out and which one you may be asking we're talking about ghost the future is a foreign land official music video came out 12 hours ago so i'm right on time and i did listen to the official audio before i actually reacted to it in case you're interested and i'll also have a playlist of other ghost songs that i've reacted to in the past at the top right um, at the end of the video so make sure you stay tuned for that and now we're gonna play this video I've only seen one other official music video from Ghost, and it was completely different. It was um, Syracuse, I think it's called. Uh, but this is animated, different style, so let's see what's going on here. Get some popcorn, fill up your water, put your headphones on. One, one. And let's go. By the way, before I forget, please comment down below your favorite song from Ghost. Feel free to pause the video now. Comment. And we're back. <laughs> the best year for music in my opinion i've said that before and i'll stand by it it's 1984 and knocking on your door it's a brown shirt In the blood of the Kennedys, the good ones get shot. And in the a absence of sympathy. Strong, like this, think about it. This is, there's deep meaning here. Like it's, it's worth a second listen. And in the absence of sympathy. Like I'm just, and I, I, I'm not going to keep pausing it, I promise. But just compared to the lyrics that uh that we see from some songs nowadays uh especially in the hip-hop industry i was just scrolling through facebook uh, or instagram today and rolling stone i don't know what happened with that magazine but they are just dropping like a tank uh, just check out rolling stone on instagram and see what they're publishing lately uh it's just kind of quotes from the popular artists of uh today's uh era and there was one i forget her name some female you know rapper and she's like <laughs> the quote is and i quote uh i like shitting on bitches uh i i do i do shitting something like that that, that was literally the quote so that's what you're publishing that's what you're trying to get out there as your message for people to get curious and and listen to your music so uh anyway that's that
is a foreign land, so let us pray for more in 2024. 
I will hold you for, I will hold you for a minute. It takes for nuclear ob oblivion to happen. Uh, of course, it was recorded and released this year. And the other two 1969 songs were released in 2019. It's all part of the lore. See, this is the, the lore. This is deep. I'm trying to learn what, you know. Huh, okay. His voice reminds me of Michael Stry. I'm just reading some of the comments, guys. Um, uh, This might be a longer video, but what the heck. If you have the time, go for it. I think the the I think Tobias, okay, that's the singer. Sounds like the singer from Interpol. Tobias. Well now let's go to the Yeah, this is the right band. So how does it how how does the lore match up here? Because it says it was formed in two thousand six. I, and you know it's gonna take a lot a long time to read all this so let me know in the comments what do you guys mean by you know this is from 1969 uh, and explain it to me like I'm five years old guys sometimes I, I just get lost sue me uh, but anyway I really enjoy the animation here it reminds me of like Scooby-Doo and what was that other show that was futuristic from like the 60s not Along the lines of like the Flintstones, that era. Old cartoons, futuristic. The something family? Jetsons, that's what it was. Reminds me of the that style of animation as well. And the concept itself. You know, like it says there, if, if the idea is that you're in 1969 and you're looking towards the future. And that's what you're picturing, right? A nuclear war everything gets destroyed they're like flying cars um the city looks more futuristic then it makes sense and uh, this was nice this was just really nice especially like how they um put the members of the band as cartoons right and this picture here like floating cities kind of ghostly looking um a bit sort of shrooms induced i would say if you get if you catch my drift um this look over here right this is cool i would get a like a sticker of this i wish the band uh put out like this on a t-shirt or something like that i would probably wear this for sure but anyway i just like i really enjoy the sound of the singer's voice because it sounds old from that era and um the instruments the i heard like the organ they have a lot of layers to their sound and this is a bit of a longer song but uh you know i i, I still enjoy i enjoy songs that are maybe a, a bit longer because you get more into it as opposed to those songs that are like less than minutes and and you it's like oh wow now it's over like like the experience is gone this one is like you have time to to really uh get in there and uh kind of like submerge yourself into what is happening especially if there's a music video but yeah guys uh please let me know in the comments if you have the answers to the questions i made and uh, i really appreciate you being here go ahead hit the like subscribe share hit me up on instagram and at the end do a flip till the next Thanks for watching.